I'm Haley. Our idea. All right, so early in the semester, we came up with the idea that we were going to create an app, and the app was going to be used to spread kindness, but we we're going to also try to incorporate that by creating a better on campus and in classroom environment. Um, with that said, if uh, the teacher could allot 10 minutes in the beginning or at the end of class for students to sign into the, to the app, and um, once students are signed in, so the, once students are signed into the app, they can uh, comment positive feedback on a presentation or an in-class discussion. Okay, so for our pitch, we, um, we were going to pitch to a president, to the president, and that was the person who was going to basically be our revenue stream. We were going to try and convince him that uh, for an annual fee, we would fix a couple of problems. So whether they happen to you or not, uh, three of the problems that we found were a lot of people can be shy. At first, obviously, um, it's hard to make friends. Orientation has a reputation of not really being a good place to make friends, and then you just kind of stuck with your with your dorm with your uh, roommates. And then, uh, intimidating environments could be like lecture or lecture classes, or even I mean, classes like this if people just don't feel comfortable opening up for the first time. Uh, so, three of our three three ways for us to solve it. Um, the app would be considered a conversation starter. We have an enough, you can be, you can give an anonymous or a direct compliment. And the direct compliment would be a conversation starter for after class. Um, you know, I mean, if you give someone a compliment, I mean, it's something to talk about after, after class. Um, it can also be a friend maker. And for people who um, don't give an, or give anonymous compliments, it's, it's just a confidence builder for people who, um, are too afraid to, to come out and say um, who they are and who uh, and give the compliment. Okay, so we're going to walk you through how to use our app. So this is the main page. When you download the app, you go on and it's give kindness. You type in your username and password, which is the same username and password you would use for Quinnipiac. So mine would be H Swartz, and then I type in my passcode. And then this will lead you to your home page where you have two options to give kindness or to look at the kindness you've received. So we're going to click give kindness. And here it says, where are you? Please select where you are on campus. And here's your options given. You can say classroom, orientation, the library, dorm room, cafe, or in the courtyard, which is the quad here. <coughs> so we click classroom. It already has your schedule loaded. So as you can see, this is my schedule. Uh, and we click and see 250 because that's where we are right now. And then your class roster comes up. So here's a class roster for your class because a lot of times you may want to give someone in your class a compliment and you don't know who they are, what their name is, but you know what they look like for the day. So you can look them up. So right now, your prompt is to look up who you want to give a compliment to. There's a couple of slides of this. So if you don't see who you want to give a compliment to right away, um, just wait, and their name will pop up, or their photo. I know it looks kind of creepy, but <laughs> I didn't get these off of Facebook. I got the roster. So, <laughs> I guess I'm sorry. Uh, go I guess you should just do. So, yeah. Sorry. So, I'm sorry if I spelled your name up. But so then the prompt is to give someone in your class a compliment based off their presentation, whether it's a group mate, how well they did, or not a group mate, someone who you just watched present. So on the next page, you would have clicked Give Compliment. So you're scribe, write a message. Please keep the messages positive and nice, but they're going through a filtering system to make sure certain words aren't said. And at the end of the day, the teachers can see everything you posted, if it's negative or positive. So if you guys want to start and write on your paper, the top part you write who it is. And then you can either check on anonymous, or you can write your name next to it. And then just write someone in the class a compliment. Try and keep it nice. There's no filtering right now, so. Here's an example if you need inspiration. Gemma, I noticed you were really nervous during your presentation, but I think you did a great job. Keep up the great work. <laughs> then once you're done, pass it to the middle. I'm <laughs> 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 